Hello everyone, you are watching the channel Incredible Facts. Amphibious assault ships are a subclass of assault ships that combine most of their function required for amphibious landings. The ships are also used to deliver amphibious military equipment or supplies to unequipped coastlines. Today, we will show you the 10 best amphibious assault ships in the world. Osumi the Osumi-type ship was designed by Mitsui Shipbuilding Company in the early 1990s. The architecture and design of the Osumi-type amphibious assault ship are based on the ideology of the American Terawa and Wasp-class multipurpose ships. The Japanese ship is a multipurpose helicopter carrier, amphibious cargo carrier, and landing helicopter dock ship. It is designed for transporting and landing troops on the shore by helicopters and amphibious assault boats, commanding the troops, evacuating the wounded and providing medical support, and also providing logistical support for the landing force. The Osumi-type ships have a flat and elongated aircraft carrier-like deck that is 583 feet 178 meters long and 85 feet 26 meters wide. It is used as a platform for two attack helicopters, but experts say the ship can be equipped with vertical takeoff and landing aircraft. Like the American multipurpose amphibious assault ships, the Osumi has a docking bay aft with two American LCAC hovercrafts or a suitable number of conventional amphibious assault boats. Yuga the Japanese Maritime Self-Defense Forces Hyuga Project helicopter carriers are Japan's first and largest helicopter carriers to enter service since World War II. Its characteristics are more similar to a light aircraft carrier. Anti-submarine defense is a priority for this type of helicopter carrier. Hyuga is capable of carrying up to 11 helicopters or vertical short takeoff aircraft. The ship is armed with OPS-20C class radar weapons. BIUS class electronic warfare weapons, FSC 3 class air defense weapons, Phalanx class anti aircraft artillery, ESSM class missile artillery, ASROC class anti submarine weapons, mine and torpedo armament, and artillery. The vessel is 646 feet 197 meters long, 108 feet 33 meters wide, and has a maximum displacement of 18,000 tons. Izumo. The Japanese Navy ship named Izumo has a deck and dimensions almost similar to the aircraft carriers Shokaku and Zuikaku, but the national government insists that it is not an aircraft carrier. The Izumo is nearly 820 feet 250 meters long and 131 feet 40 meters wide and is capable of speeds up to 30 knots 35 miles per hour. The ship has a crew of 470 and can carry an additional 500 personnel on board. In fact, the ship is a light aircraft carrier and amphibious assault ship at the same time. The Izumo is capable of carrying seven anti-submarine and two search and rescue helicopters with five roto aircraft capable of simultaneously taking off and landing on its deck. The Ministry of Defense of Japan has announced the intention to use converted planes like Osroy MV-22 on the new ship, a modern American-made aircraft which is a hybrid of an airplane and a helicopter. HMS Ocean HMS Ocean is the largest and only amphibious assault ship and helicopter carrier in the British Royal Navy and is designed for the transfer of amphibious troops and support in paratrooper operations. The landing ship has the typical architecture of a light aircraft carrier but has a flat flight deck without a springboard. At the front of the upper structure is a glass navigational combat room connected to a flight control station. The flight deck with six launching positions is 557 feet 170 meters long and 104 feet 32 meters wide, 
up to 12 AW101 Merlin and CH47 Chinook Ultra Heavy Lift helicopters can be placed on it for vertical transfer of military equipment to the coast. The aviation group includes 18 helicopters, but the aircraft and crews are not part of the permanent aviation group, but can be formed depending on the mission. Doktu The Doktu type amphibious assault ships are a series of helicopter carriers of the LPX project of the South Korean Navy. It was named after the Doktu Islands, the territory of South Korea contested by Japan. The ship is 652 feet 199 meters long and 101 feet 31 meters wide. It has a displacement of 14,000 tons empty and 18,000 tons full. It has a dock chamber for amphibious assault vehicles and LCAC hovercrafts. There is a hangar below the aircraft carrier deck. The Doktu type ship can hold 720 paratroopers, 400 crew members, 10 tanks, 10 trucks, 7 AAVs, 10 UH 60 helicopters, and 2 LCACs or 4 LCAS's boats. Self defense systems include the ASMD surface to air missile system, 21 launchers, and the Goalkeeper anti aircraft artillery system, two seven barreled 30 mm units. Mistral Mistral-type ships are French-designed, versatile assault dock ships equipped with a helicopter unit, a dock for landing boats, and excessive interior facilities to control operations far from bases and to accommodate landing troops, including heavily armored vehicles, or a hospital, or evacuees, or all of the above in various combinations. The self-defense equipment is represented by two Brenda Mauser 30mm rapid-fire artillery systems and two VS Rad-type SAMs. The ship's three-coordinate radar station is used as target designation and the weapons are directly controlled by an optoelectronic system. The Mistral ships either four landing boats LCUs, or landing hovercrafts LCACs. The aviation group consists of 16 heavy or 32 light helicopters. Juan Carlos I Juan Carlos I is an amphibious assault ship of the Spanish Navy, according to the Spanish classification. This is the ship of strategic power projection. It is similar to the American WASP-type ships in concept, but equipped with a springboard to increase the combat load of short takeoff planes. The ship has a deck with a springboard. The deck has eight landing sites for AV-8 Harrier II, F-35, or medium helicopters, four landing sites for CH-47 Chinook heavy lift helicopters, and one site for V-22 Osprey tilt rotor military aircraft. The aviation group includes up to 30 airplanes and helicopters. The ship has a crew of 900. Space is provided for 1,200 Marines. A two-level multi-purpose hangar garage has space for up to 6,000 tons of cargo and equipment. The 55 feet 16.8 meter wide aft gate dock can hold four assault barges and four inflatable landing boats or one hovercraft and floating armored personnel carriers. Canberra The multi-purpose amphibious assault ship Canberra of the Australian Navy was initiated on September 23, 2009 at the shipyard of the Spanish company Navantia, launched on February 18, 2011, and entered the National Fleet in 2014. Its armament consists of four 25mm Typhoon automatic launchers and six 12.7mm machine guns. The ship can carry six NH-90 type helicopters on the top deck and 11 in the hangar, up to 150 armored vehicles in the cargo hold or up to 1,000 Marines. The aft area includes a floodable dock chamber for four LCM-1E amphibious landers. 
As part of its wing, it is planned to have F-35B Lightning II tactical fighters with short takeoff and a vertical landing. A 22-bed hospital is equipped on board the ship. WASP the WASP-type amphibious assault ships are a series of U.S. Navy ships designed for the landing of U.S. Marine Corps units. Ships of this series were the largest of their type in the world before the development of the American-type ships. WASP-type ships have eight decks, three of them extending across the length of the ship uninterrupted. The 370 feet, 113 meter long helicopter and aircraft hangar is located at the aft end of the ship between the first and fourth decks and has a height of 27 feet, 8.4 meters. The flight deck has an airstrip for nine helicopters. The ship can accommodate F-35 fighters as well as Osprey converted planes, along with 1,100 crew members. The ship can accommodate up to 1,600 Marines. The ship also has a 600-bed hospital with six surgery wards, making the expeditionary force independent of shore-based medical facilities. America The America-type ships are a type of amphibious assault ships of the U.S. Navy. The development and construction of the America-type ships were initiated to gradually replace the Tarawa and Wasp amphibious assault ships. Their purpose is the same as that of the older types of multi-purpose assault ships, to provide amphibious assault support for an expeditionary marine or unequipped enemy coastlines. Together with amphibious equipment and air support equipment, F-35 JSF short takeoff vertical takeoff combat aircraft, MV-22 Osprey converted plane, and MH-53 Super Stallion transport landing helicopters. The LCU or LCAC hovercraft or six LCM-8 amphibious assault boats are used to land the Marine Expeditionary Battalion. The ship's crew consists of 2,800 people including 1,687 soldiers and 184 marine sergeants. That's all, friends. Thanks for watching. Write in the comments which of the ships you like the most. Also, click the like button and subscribe to our channel so you don't miss any new interesting videos.